Hello guys, this is Mike from McProgramming.org. In this video, I'm going to talk to you about what Boolean values are. And this is the easiest data type to remember. It just has two values and it's true or false. And true in computer language is a 1 and false is a 0. So how do we write a Boolean value? Well, there's a keyword for that. It's B. Ah, come on computer. It's B O O L bool. And we get, can give it a variable name. Let's just say program running. And make sure it uh, the variable name kind of reflects what you're trying to show is true or false. So I'm just going to say set this program running boolean uh, variable to true. And if we wanted to print that to the console, we would do C out space less than less than and then program running and automatically completes it for us. So we have to enter end it with the semicolon and let's run that build and run and it printed out a one right there so if we had set it to false it would give us a zero false zero well we're not usually going to print out one or zero to the screen but what a boolean value is good for is if we have some type of loop we can set flags that can turn the loop on or off and the simple syntax of a loop um, we haven't gotten into while loops yet but I'll use that as an example say while inside of these parentheses we would put some type of condition and the condition must be true in order for whatever is in these curly brackets to run so we would have we could have you know while x is less than five or something like that and we could keep track of x and increment it or decrement it and it'll run while that condition's true but we can also put in directly a boolean value and say while program running and then execute this code and eventually hopefully you would have something that turns this let's set it to true we would have something that would turn that false if it doesn't turn false, that would be what's known as an infinite loop, and whatever's inside this while loop will run infinitely until you turn your program off. But that's what Boolean values are used for mostly, are setting flags so loops can run, or not run, you know? If this was false, and we had something in here that only should run if it was true, we that would handle it right there, and we would just skip over and go to the next code in your program. So that is the basic intro to the boolean type thank you guys for watching and please subscribe below